We have all watched cartoons in our childhood and we still watch them despite our age. In this world of cartoons, we have a big company here, Walt Disney Company, which belongs to a man, Walt Elias Disney. The man who laid the basis and foundation of cartoons that we know today as animation. Animations like Mickey Mouse, Goofy and Donald Duck. His father was a farmer and due to unexpected conditions, they sold their field and moved to their uncle's property. Ever since he was little, he had passion for drawing, so he used to draw anywhere he can, leading to a barber shop where he started displaying his art. He was not able to go to a school, but when his father got a job of newspaper selling, he was able to get admission in a school but had to work with his father to make the both ends meet. Due to this, he got weak in studies but never left the passion for drawing. After many failures like joining of military, joining of art school and art studio, Walt came up with his own company with only $20 in his pocket. But with the help of his brother Roy, they upgraded the company by the name, the Walt Disney Company. His very first feature film was Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, which was a smash hit and until now, Disney has won 22 Oscars and 59 nominations. According to Macro Trends, Disney's net worth as of July 19, 2022 is $174.23 billion. Walt Disney Company has assets that span movies, television, publishing and theme parks. Now talking about working employees in Disney, their total number was 1,90,000 in 2021. If we talk about the vision statement of Disney company, it is like to be one of the world leading producers and providers of entertainment and information. This is the mission statement provided by Disney company. To entertain, inform and inspire people around the globe through the power of unparalleled storytelling reflecting the iconic brands, creative minds and innovative technology that makes our the world's premier entertainment company. Nothing is perfect, so what problems Disney is facing? Disney is trying to promote cultures like LGBT, which is causing decline in number of employees and growth rate. 